The Grand Theater has a grand show you may want to see. It's called Curtains, and today we're talking with director David Hansen. It's today's sponsored segment. David, thanks for being with us today. Pleasure to be here. So it's Curtains at the Grand Theater. Yes, it is, <laughs> in more ways than one. There you go. <laughs> what makes this show so grand? Uh, it's kind of a split show. It, it's a musical comedy, but it's also a whodunit. Okay. So you kind of get both of the roles in there, and, oh, yeah. and you get it's an insanely funny show set in a time period that pays homage to like the Rodgers and Hammerstein era of, of Broadway. So we're going so, on the way back machine oh yeah. just a little bit. Yeah, okay. back into the late 50s. Uh, <laughs> so you get to see kind of that little play on what happened there with the whodunit, with the comedy. It's just a, a riot. So you really get kind of a two for one here. Yeah. Now is this a dress rehearsal we're looking at or is this yes. the actual production? This is a dress rehearsal. Okay. Our first night on the stage. I was going to say, they look a little skimpier than I remember the 50s being at yeah, the time. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> that will change. It will be, be a little more covered. There you go. Okay, so you have that kind of murder mystery happens there in the show. Now, why is this musical so well received? It's won Tony Awards before. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and was nominated for several as well. Um, and this it put it on Broadway in 2006, so it's still fairly mm -hmm. recent when it was written. Right. But just the, the comedic value of it, the, the look that... We all kind of have that little piece of us mm -hmm. that always wants to be the performer. Sure. A and you have a character in this who's coming to solve the murder who is also a wannabe actor. So that aspect plays into it a lot. Um, and, and just people identify with that so much that when we combine all of those elements with the comedy, it just it speaks to everyone. And I think there's a lot of people who be excited about what they'll see with this show, which premieres tomorrow night. Am I correct? That is correct. How exciting is it for you to kind of that build up before you have the opening night? It is a lot of adrenaline. Oh yeah. There is so much happening in the last few days that, uh, I mean, we, we run pretty much on coffee. Right, and duct so, tape maybe. Right, yeah. <laughs> Gaff sure. tape, we use a lot of tape. <laughs> I can only imagine. Now this is a PG-13 uh, production, so uh -huh. who is this appropriate for, who is it not? Um, it, it would be considered a PG-13 for a little bit of language, okay. um, not hardcore language. But there are also some innuendos in there that uh, really aren't overt. Um, so it's not incredibly offensive, but it does have, you know, a few little things that your kids, younger kids, may not. So you may want to be more kind of judicious about who gets to come when if you're, if you're taking bit. the family. Yeah, it, okay. unless you want to, you know, voice a bunch of questions from your kids <laughs> when you get sure, home. Yeah. You, whatever right. you want to explain sure, at that that's point. That's pretty good. So if they want to check it out, when and where should they go? Well, they can go on the website at the grandtheatercompany.com okay. and purchase tickets there. We do open tomorrow night. It runs through the 26th. We generally run uh, Wednesday through Saturday. Okay. Uh, and they can purchase tickets there online. What's it like when you go to the Grand Theater, when you show up there, as opposed to other venues? It's a beautiful space. It's the old South High that has, uh, I mean, it, the auditorium is almost 100 years old. Yeah. It, the architecture is beautiful. The colors are amazing. It is such a beautiful space to work in. And it's been updated with a lot of high tech. So the quality of the shows, I think, is just off the board. So not only do you get a two-for-one with the production right there, they obviously you get to see the, the mystery, the comedy, but you also get a two-for-one. You have that old feel with the theater there at South mm -hmm. High, but then, of course, the brand new, all the theatrics that you want to go along with it, the, yep. the technical side of the production. Exactly. We even have cherubs up on the ceiling. No so kidding. look for those. There you go. All right. So you want to go check it out, we'll have the information on our website, abc4.com slash midday talking with the director, David Hansen. The show is called Curtains at the Grand Theater. David, looks like a fun show. Thanks for being with us today. Thank you.